In a heartwarming display of family unity, the Princess of Wales, Catherine, has been seen more frequently with her family in recent weeks, despite her ongoing battle with cancer, according to the Daily Mail. The royal family has been inundated with tens of thousands of Get Well Soon cards, a testament to the public's immense support for the beloved princess. While many see Catherine's outings with her family as a positive sign, Kensington Palace has emphasised that she still requires ample time and space to focus on her recovery. In March, Catherine shared a deeply emotional video message, revealing that she had begun preventative chemotherapy. This announcement was met with an overwhelming wave of support and well wishes from the British public, demonstrating the deep affection and concern for her well-being. In her heartfelt message, the princess announced her decision to withdraw from public life, to concentrate on her recovery and to protect her young family. Despite her withdrawal, the public support has not waned. The palace's correspondence team have been deeply moved by the outpouring of love and affection shown to Catherine. The volume of correspondence has been so significant that it has posed challenges for the team to manage. But they remain committed to responding to all the letters. All correspondence to the royal family is handled by the court post office. Typically, the palace receives up to 1,000 letters a week. But the number has skyrocketed since Catherine's announcement in March. This surge in support underscores the public's deep connection with the princess and their desire to offer comfort during her challenging time. According to the recent flurry of activity, Catherine was recently revealed as the driving force behind a new report advocating for more family-friendly working practices. Her Royal Foundation Business Task Force for Early Childhood unveiled a significant report suggesting that investing in early childhood could generate over 45.5 billion for the national economy each year. The report's findings have already been shared with Downing Street and senior ministers in the Department of Health and Education. However, palace officials have been keen to clarify that this initiative is not a political campaign. Despite her illness, Catherine has been intricately involved in the development of the task force's work from home. A Kensington Palace spokesperson confirmed that the princess has been kept fully updated throughout the process. The work of the Prince and Princess's projects is always on early childhood and a huge priority for the princess and so she has been kept fully updated throughout the development of the task force's work and she has seen the report the spokesperson stated. A senior royal aide added, The Princess of Wales was the driving force behind the business task force. She has been kept up to date since the inception of the task force and she has read the report and has been briefed on it. This is a clear commitment she has made that throughout her life of public service that this will be a focus. That will continue when she returns to work. But we have been really clear that she needs the space and the privacy to recover right now. She will return to work when she has the green light from doctors. While Catherine has not participated in any public engagements this year, her influence and dedication to her cause remain unwavering. The palace has reiterated that she is not expected to return to work until she receives clearance from her medical team. The princess is not expected to return to work until it's cleared by her medical team, confirmed the Kensington Palace spokesman. Catherine's increased family outings and her continued involvement in key projects from home reflect her strength and dedication, even in the face of personal challenges. The public's unwavering support and the royal family's close-knit solidarity provide a poignant backdrop to her journey. As the Princess of Wales focuses on her recovery, the nation stands with her, offering heartfelt wishes and eagerly anticipating her return to public life when the time is right.